I think you can get pulled over for going. You can. Too slow. Yeah. If you're going too slow on like a highway, they will pull you over because you're a hazard to other people that are going the correct speed limit. Well, it makes sense. Yeah. I never heard of it happening before, but. Once. Really? Yeah, it's not on cops. Lady didn't know that she was getting arrested. Like pulled over. She was like 80. And she was going on the highway like 30 miles an hour. And they followed her the whole way home. She gets out and had no idea cops were behind her whatsoever. And they were saying that she got in trouble because she's going too slow. Do you think that there's an age where yes, the elderly? Right. Yes. What do you think? 60. 60 is the cutoff. Where you 60? Should, no, I don't think it should be a cutoff. I think it's 60. No, they and that's what I'm saying. Take a test or something. Take something. Take your eye exam or whatever you have to do to, so, to show that you can still like see things and okay. hear things. And You guys are saying 60 is not old. Some people. Uh, there's some people that shouldn't be doing it when they're 30 driving. If you ask yeah, me. of course. There's some like people who like in the prime of their age. There's prime of their life. Some though. age though. Like if there's an age where you're too young to drive and you have to take tests, there should be an age when you're too old. Yeah. You at least take a test. But, but 60. You think that's, that's too young? Yes. So what are you thinking? Like 90? Like when they can't When they can't walk or talk anymore? You, you're perfectly fine when you. Oh, should, listen, I beg to differ on that one. <laughs> How can you say that if people can't even retire to like they're typically sixty five? Oh, if make you're sense. able to go to work and like <laughs> hurt do all that stuff, but you can, you aren't no. able to sit in the car and drive, correct? That's ridiculous. That's what buses are for, correct? <laughs> that's what I thought. Boom roasted. <laughs> all right, so Tim's is old people driving, and Joby's is st- <laughs> sticky t-shirts. <laughs> I would have to say that my biggest pet peeve, and it's not only. Is that me that keeps going? I don't know. I just that? heard that. It's not like I was squeaking. Uh, that's, uh, I would say that mine is not only when people do it to me, but people interrupting other people. I can't even stand. <laughs> oh, like he, right now? Yeah. Like, oh, okay. Whenever people like do it on the news, especially, like two people are debating and they keep talking over one another. I'm like, listen, guys, and especially the people who have their own news shows. They interrupt like their guests whenever they disagree with them. And I'm like, listen, you have your entire I know, show life, talk. the entire day to say anything you want. And you have to choose the exact moment where words are coming out of someone's mouth. Like, this seems like a good time to talk. Like, I don't know. It baffles I think, me. I think it's, they think that it's so important at that moment they have to say it. It doesn't matter what like, I got to get it out. I don't know. It drives me insane, too. I just want to hit people and they interrupt me. And then I'll just. That's one. I feel like sometimes people just talk and talk and talk, so you have to jump in sometimes. Yeah, that's true. Right now, continue. (laughs) (laughs) But, uh, oh, what else was I going to say? It was really important. No, it wasn't. Yeah. Oh, and another thing is that um, I hate watching, like, this this happens all the time in the news, and I absolutely hate it. Politics? Oh, it has to deal with that. And whenever they bring, like, two people who obviously disagree on any topic, and they just have them go at, and i know that they're trying to you know show the viewers yeah. different points of view i'm not even thinking that i'm thinking just tv ratings you have two people feuding you want people like yeah i agree with you, you want differences. I agree. you want to have a cup of tea yeah, yeah and people like that's watching that and i don't because i think it's annoying because what they're trying to do is they're obviously trying to convince the other person in, and they're not going to agree with them You're no just no matter time. what yeah no matter what i don't so. think people see it that way though they just see it as good tv that people are yelling at each other because that's cool oh, to watch. yeah i understand for the tv shows but uh, i don't know it just it annoys me. It doesn't really bother me. I kind of like it when people start yelling and they start throwing desks and chairs. And oh, yeah, it's entertaining. Well. Yeah. Why is that that people get so entertained about people fighting and getting Well, that's one of those things. Do you want to see someone paint a wall or do you want to see someone smash their face on? Plain and simple. <laughs> well, you definitely want to see someone get beat up. It's just well, because it's like, wall. holy crap, I can't believe that's happening. And Wow, I painted my wall yesterday. I saw that already. <laughs> so, or both at the same time. Yeah, right? I painted the wall and then pinned someone. <laughs> <laughs> then he got dual threat. <laughs> 